Hi everyone, welcome to FTE Short Talk. My name is Carol Villalta. Today, let's talk about beauty and nature. In the south of Ecuador, in Zapotillo, a spectacular phenomenon occurs every year, known as the flowering of the Guayacanes. It takes place in an area called the dry forest. It's called like this because the trees lose their foliage during the summer due to the absence of rain, projecting a panorama of absolute drought. In the rainy season, the vegetation turns green again. One of the main species of this forest is the Guayacan tree. The inhabitants of Zapotillo and the state have sought to convert the dry forest into a protected area to conserve its biodiversity and promote tourism as a source of sustainable income. With the first rains of winter, which usually occurs between December and January, the yellow flowers of the Guayacan appear and turn the dry forest into a paradise. The flowering only lasts between five to eight days. After this, the beautiful and fragrant flowers of the Guayacan will fall again, making a magical yellow carpet on the floor of the entire forest. Its maximum splendor is seen in Mangaurco, Casaderos, Paletillas and Bolaspamba, rural parishes of Zapotillo. Being a natural phenomenon, it's difficult to predict the dates on which it will occur, but that, along with the spectacular forest painted yellow by its flower, it's part of its magic. Tourists can enjoy activities such as camping, hiking, photography, cycling, cultural activities and the exquisite local cuisine with emblematic dishes such as the famous Chihualhueco. This makes the flowering of the Guayacanes one of those events we must experience at least once in our lifetime. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful time visiting our fantastic countryside.